Welcome to What Did I Just Watch, the show featuring the tastiest videos on the internet. Today we're recovering from our Thanksgiving food comas by watching dogs enjoying Barksgiving, a son surprising his family for the holidays, and the greatest turkey prank on the planet. Picture the scene. The house is filled with the delicious smell of a turkey dinner as your parents gather you around to teach you the sacred art of carving the bird. What most parents probably don't do is get their loved ones to pull out a second, smaller bird from the cavity and trick you into thinking the turkey was pregnant. Okay, so the first thing you do, get a spoon. here's your spoon. Mm -hmm. First thing you do is take the stuffing out, and it's not that hot because it's been sitting for a half hour. So whenever you cook a turkey, you have to let it sit for half an hour, and then you can start to carve it, okay? So take the stuff, Danielle, take the stuffing out of here, put the what? knife, put the knife down, put it before you cut yourself. Put it here on this side of the plate. This whole thing's full of stuffing. Just the scoop entire in there. thing in yeah. there? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like all the way up to here. It's like oh my all, God. Yeah, just scoop in there, drag it all out. Don't waste the stuffing. Put it on that thing. Are um, you like stuffing the size of this? Cut it yeah, right here. Yeah, yeah. 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 It's not all the stuffing. Yeah, it is. What is that? Hmm. What? Pull that out. This? Yeah. What is it? What is it? What is it? I swear, if it's like a baby chicken. What the hell? What is that? It's a second chicken. <gasps> Cornish hen that we put in there. Okay, it's a joke. You're so funny. Right? <laughs> Turkey <laughs> have eggs. Oh like God. chickens. It's they don't have babies. Like no, that's a sick joke. It is sick. It was funny. It's not. It wasn't funny. It was funny. That was really disgusting. Yeah, I'm sure there's no way this is gonna mentally scar those kids for years to come. I hate to see what kind of sick and twisted pranks you guys get up to at Halloween. Thanksgiving is most well known for bringing people together to celebrate all the reasons they have to be thankful. But in this next video, this guy plans to throw the biggest party for some four-legged friends who have never experienced all the joy of a Thanksgiving feast. It occurred to me that every year I get to have Thanksgiving dinner with my dogs, but there are dogs across the nation at shelters that don't get to have Thanksgiving. So this year, the team and I made up all kinds of Thanksgiving dinners, and we're going to Marley's Mutts to provide them with Thanksgiving. Now we set this up just like you would set up Thanksgiving for your family. If you think about it, a lot of dogs in shelters have never had that loving feeling that we all know that comes from gathering with friends and family at Thanksgiving. They probably never had a Thanksgiving meal, spent time with a family they could call their own on Thanksgiving, or even had the pleasure of someone sneaking them their aunt's famous stuffing under the Thanksgiving dinner table. Okay, these are the actual Barksgiving dinners. We're gonna get them set up and then we'll bring the dogs in and it's just like a, it's just like a family Thanksgiving dinner. Now these Barksgiving dinners that my team and I put together at my stores, the Dog Bakery, take hours and hours of love and care and dedication. They've got no salt or sugar, it's only the best. Now the challenge will be getting these rescue dogs to sit still long enough so we can actually get this set up. Now that's Titan, and that's Hooch. And these are just two of the dogs at Marley's Mutts that have a harrowing story. They were abused and beaten and battered and unimaginable things were done to these dogs. And this will no doubt be their first Thanksgiving. Hooch doesn't have a tongue, so we're gonna have to wet the food down and, and put it down the hatch. Yeah, so let's grab a bowl for Hooch so we can water him. Yeah, we can make it more of like a mush. Let's just turn it all into a uh, stuffing. <laughs> okay, so this is Barksgiving at Marley's Mutts. It's like family. Let's get this Barksgiving started. Chow down. Happy Thanksgiving. Can you start with your cornbread. 
There you go. So this When you look at Titan's face, it's easy to think of scarring and fear and pain. But if you look close enough, you see a dog that is forgiving and loving and kind. And while this is his first Thanksgiving, you can tell that he now knows it won't be his last. And if enough people see him, surely someone will take him in forever. You always have that family member that makes a big mess at the table. And in this family, it's Hooch. He doesn't have a tongue, but that doesn't slow him down from playing, loving, being a dog, and having his first Barksgiving dinner. There's really no approach to this. You can go dessert first. That's the strategy over what, here. Uh, Shasta, I mean, um, yeah. that will be his done. Look at this, Titan's being... And then Titan is just a quite debonair. And his, uh, yeah, starting with the pie, then moving to the stuffing. Yeah. So, uh, Rocky wants to do something nice for all the dogs uh, for Thanksgiving. It's an opportunity for us to... Um, to reflect and give thanks to all of you guys for supporting us. Um, to just rescue the general, to reflect on where we've been, where we're going, what we've done, and uh... Zach's right. This is a perfect time to reflect and give thanks. And it appears that our four-legged friends are more like us than we ever could have imagined. Not only were they appreciative of this Thanksgiving, but like a lot of families, it got a little unruly. Shelby, was rude and wouldn't take her elbows off the table. Shelby's gotta feed that tumor, man. I got it. And Uncle Shadow downright lost control, jumped on the table, and started eating everybody else's food. Nonetheless, I think we can call this a success. I love Barksgiving. This is such a good video with a truly meaningful message behind it, and I really hope all these dogs find forever homes. This vlogger is on a mission to sneak her brother Brent inside the house to give her parents an epic Thanksgiving surprise. Poor Brent has to lay low in the basement while his sister convinces them to go downstairs and meet him. My brother is actually here from North Dakota. He hasn't been here since last summer or something crazy and my parents have no clue that he is going to be here for Thanksgiving. I have Brent with me and we are about to surprise my mom and dad. We're gonna take him, I'm gonna let him in the back door in my basement, and then I'm gonna call my parents down there and say I hung up something in my basement. They're gonna be so they're happy. Gonna see Brent, he's here. I hope they're happy. <laughs> they're gonna be like, I hope, they're not, I hope they're not bummed. No. <laughs> my is burning. Damn it. Hey, I got something to put in the basement. I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, cool! Oh my gosh, guys. I'm so nervous. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my gosh. My heart's beating so fast. On a scale of one to ten, how happy are you to have a surprise? Ten? Always. <laughs> hurry, hurry, hurry. It's on the stool. On the stool? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't you tell me that. that. <laughs> I didn't tell you that? No, okay, you good. Know. You told me about your track boy. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, it's great. Surprise. Are you scared? Or are you... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> they got scared you first. Ah, <laughs> uh, we went to Indianapolis and Trent picked me up yesterday. Oh my god! I got there like six or seven. Oh! Oh, what a secret! Can't pick me up at Seymour. Is that why you had to leave this morning and you wanted to take my car? Yeah. Oh. I thought that. Mom. I, I thought I told you. I was like, oh no. Oh, what a good Thanksgiving. This is gonna be hard to top next year. The only surprise I've seen at Thanksgiving is that one time I set the turkey on fire. 
That wraps things up for this week. Make sure you leave a comment below to let me know which clip was your favorite, and then make sure you like the video, hit subscribe, and click the bell so you don't miss anything Daily Mail has to offer.